Vettel who wants to pounce all over him. Out comes the Corvette. It's all up to the Brazilian now. Will it be Samba time or will Gar Robinson take it home for Texas? Here we go. Uh, Gar got a pretty good start on him. He's st st stuck right with him. Good restart by Bufamonte in third. Francis Jr. under pressure from Buck in fifth place. But Rafa holding him off at the moment. Good start from Ernie Francis Jr. He's reacted well. He's coming up on Bufamonte. Bufamonte! Jinks to the inside. He's going to have a go at Gar Robinson. He's side by side but can't quite do it and he has to lift off. And somehow Gar Robinson survives. But boy did he have to break late. He got sideways for a moment but managed to gather it all. Meanwhile, Rafa Matos holding them all off and not in any of these fights at the moment, but trying to go as hard as he can through five. Heading up for six of the long back straight for the last time. This is going to be oh, the best oh, part of the oh, race course. Watch it. Bufamonte surely going to get alongside him as they go down the back straight. Bufamonte. And that is just what Ma Matos wants yeah, exactly. to see. You know, now he doesn't have to drive out of, that's the hardest thing, not to drive out of your mirror. Um, but with, uh, ooh, Gar's locking it up. Yeah, Gar's in a lot of trouble at the restart. Oh, oh Bufamonte Monte. gets a touch. Was that Ernie Francis that had a touch, or was there a mechanical problem? But Bufamonte's still going, but he's lost a spot of 34. Francis has gone through, and he's up to third, and that's just what Francis Jr. wanted. Butts up to fourth, and now Bufamonte fifth. Real disaster for Tony Bufamonte, who was looking so good for the weekend after yesterday. Rafa Matos, though, meanwhile, is headed for his third victory of the season. The number 88 has looked sublime and superb here around Belle Isle all weekend long. And as Tom Michaels put it, he's not put a foot wrong. Brilliantly done by Rafa Matos. The former indie man impresses brilliantly here in Trans Am, his new home. And possibly you are looking at the potential new champion in weeks to come. Indianapolis, just around the corner, another place where Matos will want to go well. But that was a superb performance under tough conditions. 